Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today we are going to talk about the situation in Japan and uh, how everything is progressing there. Uh, if you missed the news on New Year's Day, they were hit with a series of major earthquakes. I want to say the largest was 7.6, and it was shallow, which tends to mean it's its effects are going to be felt in a stronger way. The, uh, the city of Tokyo actually felt it, which is about 180 miles away, uh, 300 kilometers or so. Okay, so thousands of homes have been destroyed. At time of filming, the, uh, the human loss stands at uh, right at 50, I want to say 48. That number is expected to go up. There are 3,000 first responders out there working normal first responders, um, types that you would expect. The defense forces, uh, Japan's military, has deployed as well. There's at least 1,000 of those from what I understand. It is a race against time period. Um, there is a uh, high likelihood that there are going to be aftershocks for people who are in collapsed buildings that they are trying to get out. Those aftershocks, they could present a, a much larger problem. The weather is also not being helpful. Um, it is a forecast to rain. The rain with the crumbling buildings, making things slick, making things move, it, it, is, not, it is not going well. Um, so they're doing everything they can. Uh, multiple countries, including the U.S., have offered assistance. But realistically, it, it doesn't seem like there's much to do that isn't already being done. Um, so that's, uh, that's how that is moving along. It, it is them trying to get as many people out as they can before the weather or aftershocks make the situation worse. Um, this is probably a good reminder, especially at the beginning of the year. Make sure that you, wherever you are, whatever natural disaster you uh, may encounter where you live, make sure you have your stuff together. Um, make sure that you have the stuff that you need if there was to be an emergency where you're at. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.